Hello, all you magnificent people. Derpo the Magnificent here, and we're back with Undertale. Whoop de doo. Yeah, it's been a couple days. I've had quite a lot of trouble getting my internet working and stuff like that. Um, but we're back. Finally. It took a little bit. Um, but yeah, we're back. Hooray! And I also, for some reason, have, like, a huge amount of disk space open. And I don't know why. It just came out of nowhere, and I everything's still installed and everything. I didn't change anything, but I suddenly have a hundred gigabytes free. And so yeah, let's go talk to this crazy cat guy who's amazed at a donut. I, I, I ended up buying a donut. I, I, I didn't want to, but that girl, even though I told her no, she kept staring at me in this creepy way, licking her lips. N now I'm out of cash. As if, as, as, yeah, okay. Welcome to our parlor, dearie. Interested in some spider pastries? All proceeds go to real spiders. It looks like some sort of powerful bracelet. Wait, it's just a croissant. <laughs> it's a spider donut. It looks more rubbery than usual. Spider Bake Sale. All proceeds go to real spiders. Buy a spider donut for 9,999 gold? Uh, no. Wow, that's some crazy... Okay. I'm assuming those are, like, ridiculously powerful, if they're even obtainable. So, uh... What? Isn't this, like, Muffet or whatever? Don't I fight? Uh, maybe I'll fight that thing later. I know, because there's a... I own the soundtrack, and there's a song called Spider Dance. And it's battle music. So, oh, forget it, whatever. We'll just, we'll just keep right on walking. Oh, I, I forgot to start my timer. There we go. My timer has started now. Now we can play the game. Okay, I have no idea which... We're going... No, we're not. We're going this way. Wow, okay. Alright, we're gonna go to this one. Because I think this is. Oh! It's a random encounter. Ah, crap. Sunder plane and. Sunder plane attacks! Not because its jealous Vulcan is paying attention to you. <laughs> um. Approach Sunder plane. Ooh! I don't know what that is, but I don't like it. Wow. Hey! Vulcan is wiggling its weird rump. Spare that thing. You're hurt! I'll help. No, you won't. You're not helping. That's worse. You're making it worse. Vulcan reassures you the plane is turning tiny. The plane turning tiny is, like, completely unintentional. Oh, completely intentional, sorry. I'll learn to read one of these days. Let's criticize. You tell Vulcan that its attacks are not helpful. Uh, not helping? Okay. Vulcan stands in the corner. Fine, I'll give him a hug. You give Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart. And your whole body. Ouch. Your defense dropped. Ah, so lovely. Yep, here's your famously helpful attacks again. There you go. Get out of here. A hundred gold. Holy cow. Oh, goody. More of these things. I'm assuming this just says the same thing. Yep, it does. All right. Ah, I only have one shot this time. Ah! I don't know how I did that, but there you go. Congratulations! Sweet. Ooh! My fave Metaton moment, TM. Right when everything looks the baddest, he, posi he poses dramatically. Like when he's on a cooking show and the eggs don't turn out right. My fave Metaton moment, TM, is when he beats up the heel-turning villains. Even if it's during what's supposed to be a quiz show. Well, alright then. Is it just me, or are these faster? They seem to be a lot faster. Well, alright then. Don't know why they made them so complicated, because... They're not really complicated enough to... Oh. How do I... 
I don't know how I'm supposed to actually get through those without getting hurt or hit by the lasers. That's a bit odd. Ring. Hey, hey. This um, doesn't have anything to do with guiding you, but... Uh, hey, would you want to watch a human TV show together sometime? It's called, um, Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. If I'm being honest, no. But for the sake of the game, sure. Really? No. It's so good. It's um, my favorite show. It's all about this human girl named Mew Mew, which humans don't have, so she's all sensitive about them. But like, eventually she realizes that her ears don't matter. That's her friends, like, despite the ears. It's really what the English was so bad. <coughs> <coughs> uh, she can't, uh, they don't remember anything after the... Okay, great, awesome. Eventually, she realizes that... Okay, well, I almost spoiled the whole show, but, uh, I think you'd really like... Holy crap. You give me a run for my money here. We should watch it after you get through with all this. Click. Oh, jeez. One shot. I don't know how I did that, but once again, it was just me mashing the buttons, and it worked, so... Congratulations! Thank you very much, narrator man. Oh, Cactus! Cactus, wait! You stopped to smell the flowers. Oh. Well, it's a good thing I did. Alright, so now I gotta go this way, I think. Yes. Awesome. i done it. Yeah! Awesome doors. Safe point! The smell of cobwebs fills the air. You're filled with determination. Uh, cobwebs don't smell good, though. They smell like, you know, nothing. Oh, I guess this is where we meet Muffet. Oh. <laughs> I guess I don't really have to read that, because it said that... Did you hear what they just said? Uh, I didn't. They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I apologize for this. I'm not good at female voices. I heard that they hate you. I heard that they hate spiders. Uh, yeah, I, I do. I heard that they love to stomp on them. I don't, actually. I just love to avoid them at all costs. I heard that they like to tear their leg. Oh my gosh, wait, I could do Smeagol. Can I? Oh man, it's been such a while. It's been a while. Uh, what does Smeagol do? I heard that they like to tear their legs off. Almost there. I heard. Oh, I'm getting caught. Oh, there we go. That they're awfully stingy, stingy with their money. <laughs> you think your taste is too refined for our pastries, don't you, dearie? <laughs> I disagree with that notion. I think your taste is exactly what those nut spots need. Spider dance, yeah! Muffin traps you! Let's pay. You pay ten gold. Muffet reduces her attack for this turn. Don't look so blue, my dearie. Ah, oh, crap. I think purple is a better look on you. Crap. You're trapped in a strange purple web. Why so pale? You should be proud. Ah, so I understand how this works. This is gonna be difficult. All the spiders clap along to the music. Wow, that you're going to make a delicious cake! <laughs> okay, so I should learn all the attacks, and then I can know when to pay. Smells like freshly baked cobwebs. Um... 40 gold? Holy crap, check. If she invites you to her parlor, excuse yourself. <laughs> Let you go? Don't be silly. Brilliant. 
bring it on. Actually, please don't. Muffet does a synchronized dance with the other spiders. Uh, struck. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet covers her mouth and giggles at you. Your soul is going to make every spider very happy. Muffet does a synchronized dance with the other spiders. No oh, good parachuting dudes. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet laughs and claps her hands. Oh, how rude of me. I almost forgot to introduce you to my pet. It's breakfast time, isn't it? How fun you two. Oh, wow. Okay, that's really rude. Oh, crap! Oh, no! What is going on? This is terrifying! Muffet does a synchronized dance. This is horrifying. Uh, hold on, I'm just gonna keep struggling. You struggle to escape the web. Muffet is so abused by your antics that she gives you a discount. A person who warned us about you. What about him? Oh, gosh. Muffet does a synchronized dance. Wow. You struggle to escape the web. Nothing happened. Muffet does a lot of money for your soul. Really? Ow. Wow, I could've just hit on the bottom row. Muffet tidies up the web around you. I did get a... You pay 20 gold. Muffet reduces her attack for this turn. They had such a sweet smile on there. Oh my gosh. Oh jeez. Smells like freshly baked cobwebs. I'm a key stroller. You struggle to escape the web. Nothing happened. It's strange, but I swear I saw them in the shadows. Changing shape. Oh, well that's just freaking lovely. Oh my... How do I avoid these? Wow. Synchronized dance. Okay, I have to pay here. Because it's... It's the... It's the pet. Oh, it's lunchtime, isn't it? And I forgot to feed my pets. This music is super legit. Oh my gosh. And here comes the difficult bit. Oh gosh! It's a muffin, I just realized. It's a giant spider muffin of ow pain. Holy crap. Holy crap, that's not easy. I'd be clapping too if I wasn't so <laughs> freaking concerned. With that money, the spider clans can finally be reunited. I'm terrified? Yes, that's the word. Oh good, just those things. That's not too bad. You struggled to escape the web. Nothing happened. You haven't heard? Spiders have been trapped in the ruins for generations. I have no idea what to do. Crap. Uh, I'm okay. For now. Trying to escape, nothing happened. Even if they go under the door, Snowden's fatal cold is impossible alone. Oh my gosh, I hate these things. No idea how they work. Okay, I'm good. Well, I do, but there's so many of them. This one's easy. But with the money from your soul, we'll be able to rent them a heat. A heated limo. Oh, that's just kinda rude. Although, I managed it. This is not easy. With all of the leftovers, we could have a nice vacation. We even build a baseball field. I have no idea what to do. I apologize if this is... Well, frustrating to watch, because... I don't know what to do. I think I just gotta keep going. Let's eat a hot dog. You eat the hot dog? Your HP was maxed out. <coughs> but enough of that. It's dinner. It's time for dinner, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so that's why I ate something, because... Holy crap, wow. Uh, because this, yeah. The giant muffin. The Muffin Man! The less friendly one. The one that there's not a song about. Or maybe this is the one in the song. I wonder if he just straight up kills me if I get to him. Oh! 
You're still alive? <laughs> oh, my pet. Looks like it's time for dessert. Huh? A telegram for the spiders and the wardens? What? They're saying that they saw you and... Even you- Oh, no! I should have bought something! Oh, wait, but I never heard a single spider. Oh, my. This has all been a big misunderstanding. I thought you were someone that hated spiders. The person who asked for that sword. They must have meant a different human in a striped shirt. Sorry for all the trouble. I'll make it up to you. You can come back here anytime, and for no charge at all. I'll wrap you up and let you play with my pet again. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll spare you now. Hey! Muffin despairing. You won. You got jack crap. <laughs> That was fun. See you again, dearie. Ah, uh, my throat couldn't really take much more of that. <coughs> well, there we go. Ooh. It's a poster for Metaton's latest stage performance. A tragic tale of two star-crossed lovers, kept apart by the tides of fate. Looks like it's almost time for the performance. Ah, oh, crap. More Metaton. You have no idea how long it takes to edit in the robotic voice. Oh, that human. Could it be? My one true love? Oh, gosh. <laughs> hey there, Metaton. How's it going? All right, I guess. I I'm not singing. You can read. I'm getting out of here. Oh, crap. How do I get out of here? Do I just... I can't... I can't stop him or nothing. Will he push me? No, he won't. Oh. What the flip? I have no idea what that says, I'm sorry. My parameter will surely per perish. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, heavens have mercy, the horrible colored tile maze. Each colored tile has its own sadistic function. For example, a green tile sounds a noise, and then you must fight a monster. Oh, you're gonna screw it up, aren't you? Wow. Red tiles will... Actually, wait a second. Didn't we see this puzzle about a hundred rooms ago? That's right, you remember all the rules, don't you? Great, but I won't waste your time repeating them. Yeah, I'll be fine. Oh, and you better hurry. Because if you don't get through in 30 seconds, you'll be incinerated by these jets of fire. <laughs> My poor love. I'm so filled with grief. I can't stop laughing. Good luck, darling. Well, I'm screwed. Why is this slowing me down? How do I get out of here now? I'm stuck. Oh, what? Oh, okay. Oh, I'm so sorry. Looks like you've run out of time. Yeah, whatever. 
Here come the flames, darling. Pretty sure that's impossible. They're closing in. Getting closer, oh my! I'll be fine. Any minute now! <coughs> Ring. Watch out! I'll save you! I'm hacking into the firewall right now. Yeah, I knew it. Oh no! How could this happen? Foiled again by the brilliant Dr. Alphys! That's right. Come on, Metaton. Give up already. You'll never be able to defeat us. Not as long as we work together. Your puzzle's over. Now go home and leave us alone. Puzzle? Over? Alphys, darling. What are you talking about? Did you forget what the green tiles do? They make a sound. Then you have to fight a monster. Well, darling, that monster is me. Metaton attacks. You yell. Nothing happened. This is it, darling. Say goodbye. Is that your phone? You better answer it. Hey, hey, this seems bad, but don't worry. There's one last thing I installed on your phone. You see that yellow button? Go to this phone's act menu and press it. Your phone's act menu is glowing. Well, I don't... You press the yellow button. The phone is resonating with Metaton's presence. This is it, darling. Say goodbye. Oh, gosh. What are you doing? No! Are you reversing my controls? Now press C! Take this! Oh! Oh! You've defeated me! How can this be? You are stronger than I thought, he CC. Whatever. Ring. It looks like you beat him. Y you did a really great job out there. All thanks... Uh... All thanks to you. What? Oh no, I mean... You're the one doing everything cool. I just wrote some silly programs for your phone. Um, hey, this might sound strange, but... Can I tell you something? B before I met you, I didn't really... I didn't really like myself very much. For a long time, I felt like a total screw-up. Like I couldn't do anything without... Without ending up letting everybody down. But guiding you has made me feel a lot better about myself. So thanks for letting me help you. Uh, anyway, we're almost to the core. It's just past MTT Resort. Come on, let's finish this. Let's finish this. Alrighty. Dramatic music. Oh, sweet. Wait, where do these go? Oh, okay. I can't go up there. Um, uh, what about over here? We got... An elevator! <gasps> Heat's Flamesman! Hey, hey! Oh, wait. Hey, hey, do you remember my name? Did you? Yeah. What? You remember? How could I be so easily defeated? <laughs> I always remember that you remembered. It's Heat's Flamesman, bro. It's a good name. Alrighty. Hey, it's you again. Business is excellent here. These two fellas bought all my ice cream. I've actually sold out of everything. Sorry. Wait, I've still got something for you. A big smile. How about that? Ah, thanks, Rabbit Man. Oh, hey. We're, like, taking a rain check on that killing you thing. Like, don't tell Undyne about this, okay? He seems happy. Good for them. Hey! Go up to the creepy alleyway on the right for some great deals. Okay, hold on, I gotta talk to Sans. It's been a while. Hey, I heard you're going to the core. How about grabbing some dinner with me first? Uh, hold on, let me go to the... creepy alleyway to the right. Unless this is the way I'm supposed to... Oh, it's a shop. I am... Um, I have no idea what to... No voices. I'm sorry. 
I have no idea what to do. 17 HP has a big bite out of it. Empty gun. Bullets not included. Wow. That's really powerful. Attack up when worn. I don't want that. It's super expensive. Probably someone's house. Probably to someone's house. Well, yeah. I'm buying that just because... Yeah. It, it's probably important. Hmm. Well, I'm getting out of here because I can't voice them. Sorry. <sighs> Mystery key. Alright. Mystery key. Unique. It is too bent to fit into your keychain. Awesome. Uh, anything else? No. Okay. Alright. Now we will go on another, I guess, date with Sans. Oh, gosh, sorry. Sans! I've been watching Craddock play, and he calls him Sans. Ugh. Great. Thanks for treating me. Over here. I know a shortcut. Where are we going to eat? Are we going back to... Oh. Well, here we are. So, your journey's almost over, huh? You must really want to go home. Hey, I know the feeling, but oh. Though... Maybe sometimes it's better to take what's given to you. Down here, you've already got food, drink, friends. Is what you have to do really worth it? I don't know. Ah, forget it. I'm rooting for you, kid. Hey, let me tell you a story. So I'm a sentry in Snowden Forest, right? I sit out there and watch for humans. It's kind of boring. Fortunately, deep in the forest, there's this huge locked door, and it's perfectly for and it's perfect for practice and knock knock jokes. So one day, I'm knocking them out like usual. I knock on the door and say knock knock, and suddenly, from the other side, I hear a woman's voice. Who is there? So naturally, I respond, dishes. Dishes who? This is a very bad joke. <laughs> yes, it is. Then she just howls with laughter. Like it's the best joke she's heard in a hundred years. So I keep them coming, and she keeps laughing. She's the best audience I've ever had. Then, after a dozen of them, she knocks and says, Knock, knock. I say, who's there? Old lady. Old lady who? Oh, I did not know you could yodel. Wow. Needless to say, this woman was extremely good. We kept telling each other jokes for hours. Eventually, I had to leave. But Byrus gets kinda cranky without his bedtime story. <laughs> but she told me to come by again, and so I did. Then I did again, and again. It's a thing now. Telling bad jokes through the door. It rules. One day, though, I noticed she wasn't laughing very much. I asked her what was up, and she told me something strange. If a human ever comes through this door, could you please, please promise something? Watch over them and protect them, will you not? Ah, it's Toriel. Oh crap, does that mean if I had killed Toriel like I actually did? Oh gosh, I don't even want to think about that. Now, I hate making promises, and this woman, I don't even know her name, is Toriel. But, someone who sincerely likes bad jokes has an integrity you can't say no to. Do you get what I'm saying? That promise I made to her. You know what would have happened if she hadn't said anything? Buddy. You'd be dead where you stand. Hey, lighten up, bucko. I'm just joking with you. Besides, haven't I done a great job protecting you? I mean, look at yourself. You haven't died a single time. That's not true. Hey, what's that look supposed to mean? Am I wrong? Heh. <laughs> 
Well, that's all. Take care of yourself. Cause someone's really so cause someone really cares about you. I really like Sans. I have no idea where I am though. Originally we dug mazes for puzzles in order to foil human attacks. But now building things winding and confusing. It's some awful tradition. You can't go two feet without being up to your armpits in puzzles. I work at the core. We inside is a ah. The inside is a maze made of swappable parts. That means we can shuffle the layout at will. Boy, was today a fun day. I sure love puzzles. I'm the resort comedian. I'm very funny. People laugh at my jokes. Now, my son, he wants to be a comedian like his father. Hey, this guy actually has an accent. But his jokes aren't funny. He tells these awful puns. He's an embarrassment to our family. <laughs> That's not funny. Since his mother passed on, he couldn't stand living at home anymore. So he ran away. I haven't seen him since. I'm terrible. I'm a terrible father. <laughs> That's not funny. <laughs> Alright then. Oh, gosh. Blub blub. You'll have to reserve a table to eat here. You'll also need to reserve your chair, your silverware, your food, your... Wow. Oh, okay, same thing. No, I'm sorry. Jeez. Let's get out of here. Holy crap. There's an inscription on this fountain. Royal Memorial Fountain, built in 2001X. Metaton added last week. <laughs> the relaxing atmosphere of this hotel. It fills you with determination. Awesome. Welcome to MTT Resort, Hotland's biggest apartment, building to building <laughs> Hotland's biggest apartment building turned hotel. Whether you're here for a night or still live here, MTT Resort prides itself on a great stay. Just passing through? Nice! MTT Resort prides itself on being passed through. Alrighty then. It's a potted plant. <sighs> Making up voices is getting difficult. This elevator goes straight to the cab, but it stopped working. The hotel's doing a spit to accommodate everybody stuck here. Yeah, I'm not gonna be home tonight. Um, I think there's some cold pizza in my treasure hoard you could eat up. It's a slime. I'm outmaged. Alright. Well, I have no idea what to do here. There's so much stuff. It's a hand. Yes, we know. The elevator to the city is not working. Because of this incident, rooms are running at a special rate. 200 gold a room. Interested? Eh, no. I don't really have much. Do let us know if you change your mind. Have a spectacular day. No. I will have a magnificent day. Alright, I'm gonna save, and that'll be it. Alrighty! So... It has been quite a while since I recorded and stuff, but, you know, I'm finally back. I apologize for the little delay, but, uh, you know, whatever. You got your videos back, and that's nice. So, uh, yeah. Uh, that is it for this episode. Hope you all have a magnificent day. Derpo the Magnificent out.